Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a Facebook business page. Go to pages, create a page, and fill out the information. The page name is what people are going to see when they click on your page, so make it something memorable. Add a category, it's going to be real estate, of course. A short description of what your page is about, local Orlando Realtor, local Florida Realtor. You can put something specific to you. If you want a business in the area, you can add that. After you do that, you will be able to customize your page. You can see there is no photo in the banner and no photo in the profile. So. You're going to scroll down, add a profile image, make it something at least semi-professional, something that will show people who you are. I'm going to use Melissa's photo. Same thing with the cover. I'm going super general, but you can order custom cover photos off Etsy, or you can create your own on things like Canva. Once you save that, it is going to take you to your business page. If you have a WhatsApp, I suggest connecting it and that is how people will reach you. As you can see on the page, you can create an at username. If you already have an Instagram account, you might want to either use the same username or connect them and then your Instagram and Facebook will be connected. Make it something short and easy to remember unlike what I just posted. People like to have fun at so people can remember them more easily. I know a lot of people have first name sells Florida, first name sells real estate. There is insights and little steps you can follow to complete setting up your page. There is also buttons you can add to your profile. And depending on your business, they have everything you need. Of course, with real estate, you'll probably use book now, call now, contact us, send a message, or send an email. When you have contact us, it auto-populates a question and then an auto-response. This is a really good option so you don't have to constantly be replying to things unless it's very specific. I highly suggest after creating your Facebook business page, you take the tour that is often provided there you can switch between your personal account and your business account. By playing around in the system, you get a better idea of what you have access to. Always invite people because no one will know you have a page unless you invite them. And who knows, maybe those people will push your page. There's also an ad center. You can create ads to promote your page. And insights. Once you've been on it for about a month, you'll get a really good idea of how people interact with your page, what things in bring most engagement, days and times that you should be posting for the highest engagement. Always fill out your about section. This is how people get to know you. And join pages so you can learn about your community and your field. There's a video on our page going into the publishing tools on Facebook Business Suite. I highly suggest checking out that video. Hope you guys found this video informational and I will see you in the next one.